this video we are going to understand about curves how often in our life do we come across certain lines which are not straight so you could have something like this you can have something like this you have the garlands which are like this okay then what else you have various objects the snake a snake is like this so all these lines which are not straight in normal parlance are called curves but there could also be a situation where there could be something like this which is kind of a bit straight but a bit hazy daisy so these lines which are called curves and curves basically can be of two types one is your open curve and the other can be a closed curve and one is definitely a simple curve simple curve basically is a curve which does not cross itself so like let me give you an example this curve nowhere crosses itself does it it doesn't this curve also doesn't crosses itself now suppose i had something like this now this curve basically crosses itself at this point so this is not a simple curve a simple curve is a curve which does not crosses itself okay that is one now how about an open curve an open curve is something like this which is open from any of the sides this is also an example of open curve again this is an open curve whereas a cold closed curve could be something say let, let's take this is a golf course area you have this so this golf course area basically is a closed curve why because it closes a particular region now there could be in your cases when you go through a geometry there could be three situations in a closed curve there could be the point which could be inside the curve let's say a point a this is point a now this is inside the curve my curve is this this point is inside the curve there can be a point on the curve this is inside the curve and then there could be outside the curve let's say a point c this particular area which is covered by the curve this entire area is basically known as the region of the curve so these are some of the basic points that one should know about the curves when we go towards the advanced questions when we go towards some advanced problems then basically we will come to know about more about these curves and their usage 